Hello, and welcome to Week 1 of Woods Corps 100, Into the Woods, Out of the Woods. My name is Kathy Pickrell. Our journey through the woods begins by learning about self. What is self? Merriam-Webster in 2020 defined self as an individual's typical character or behavior. It includes the elements that, taken together, form the person, including physical attributes and characteristics, the psychosocial being that includes intellect, emotions, and cognitive aspects, and the perceptual self, including beliefs, thoughts, and sensations. What the self encompasses, then, is the whole being, when you look at the self and who you are, you are discovering your identity, who you are, and what you will become. This presentation supports the program learning outcome, communication. Clearly articulate thoughts and ideas in written and oral forms by selecting the appropriate tools and media relative to the audience. The outcome of this week's module will help you achieve the student learning outcome, discover individual identity, strengths, and areas for improvement. Following this presentation, students will understand self, identity, and strategies to improve those strengths as they grow. The focus of the modules this week, then, is on understanding self, connecting self and identity, and expanding self to connect to others. Self encompasses your identity. Identity is who you are, the qualities or attributes that make you unique. Identity encompasses your personality, your individuality, and your uniqueness. Think about the qualities that make you unique. For some, the first thing they think about is their appearance. For others, it is their personality types. Still others may say, I am different or unique because. Self also means to look at how you function. What is it you do well? And for those of you who are students, it is, how do you learn? One way to learn about self is to undertake a self-assessment that includes your core competencies. Core competencies are enduring skills and attributes that allow students to engage in lifelong learning. And this is from, from Benjamin in 2018. The self-assessment you, allows you to build on your strengths so that you can learn to effectively collaborate with others, to improve your critical thinking skills, and to communicate effectively. Self-assessment promotes personalized, evidence-based reflections where you own the learning and build an understanding of self. Self-assessment is an ongoing process, not a one-time event. In Woods Core 100, you will complete a self-assessment at the beginning and after the midpoint of the class so that you can evaluate your progress. You can also add a written summary of the self-assessment to the ePortfolio. Another way to learn about self is through a learning style inventory. Some educators believe that learning styles are defined as the cognitive processes by which we acquire a skill or learn new knowledge. They are natural or habitual patterns of processing information in learning situations. Proponents of learning styles believe that people differ in how they learn and that instructors can adapt their teaching methods to meet the individual needs of each student's learning style. There is insufficient research, though, to support the validity of using learning styles in education. Kazan states, evidence suggests that people aren't really one certain kind of learner or another. There is little evidence to support that if you know your learning styles, you will have better outcomes in the form of your grade. 
In Woods Core 100, you will complete a learning style inventory and compare your results with what you already know about how you learn. However, when you complete the learning styles inventory, your results will be grouped into three categories, visual, auditory, and kinesthetic. The results list learning styles as a percentage from each category. The results mean that you should not try to learn one style or another, but you will learn by a variety of methods. For example, you may learn by both auditory and visual methods with a little bit of show me how to do it and I will do it thrown in. There are more styles than the three that are listed. Seven learning styles including visual, physical, oral or auditory, verbal, logical, social, and solitary have been suggested by Lynch. There is no one way to learn and not one way to teach. There are a variety of teaching methods to help you gain the knowledge you need to succeed in Woods Corps 100 and the college. You are welcome to make suggestions about others that you find beneficial as well. Once you get to know yourself, you can expand your identity to include others and become connected to them. We are connected to our families, our communities, and St. Mary of the Woods College. Several activities in Woods Core 100 allow you to become connected to each other. By updating your profile, you are telling others how to connect with you. You can add your SMWC email address, your telephone number, an optional nickname, and other information as you wish, which is also optional. It is always a good idea to request permission from each other before you make telephone calls, though. Introduce yourselves. Share your name, where you are from, and what your major is. Then answer the question, if you were forced to wear a warning label, what would yours say? There are other ways to contact each other as well. You can make connections through chats and instant messaging. The Student Lounge is a forum on the Woods Core 100 course site that allows you to engage in discussions that are off limits to the instructor. Netiquette rules apply in all online communications. Discussions will allow you to exchange ideas and questions about specific topics each week. Discussion topics require you to think critically, reflect on specific issues, and compare and contrast information with each other. Let's put it all together. What the self encompasses then is your whole being. When you look at the self, and who you are, you are discovering your identity, how you will learn, and what you will become. At St. Mary of the Woods College, we provide opportunities for individual discovery of meaning and purpose at the intersection of faith and reason for the development and growth of the whole person. The infographic here is you as you grow and learn at St. Mary of the Woods. These are the references that I have used for this presentation. Thank you very much for watching this video presentation of SELF.